In the 20th century, scientists introduced a theory called the Big Bang model. It was created to explain how the universe began, how it has changed, and why it keeps expanding. The model became widely accepted, but it doesn't answer all the big questions. Some mysteries of the universe remain unexplained, leaving room for curiosity and debate. In recent years, space research has revealed strange new discoveries. One of the most surprising came in 2023, when NASA's James Webb Space Telescope captured images that seemed to show galaxies older than the universe itself. This finding shocked astronomers and made them rethink what they believed. Could stars really exist that formed before the universe began? If that were true, it would challenge everything science has told us about the beginning of time. It may mean we need new ideas or even a new way of understanding the entire universe. One of the most fascinating examples lies about 200 light years away, in the Leo constellation. There, a star called HD 140283 has drawn global attention. This star is often nicknamed Methuselah, after a biblical figure known for his long life. What makes it stand out is not just its speed but its age. It travels through space at nearly 45 kilometers per second, suggesting it may have had a chaotic past. Scientists believe it came from a smaller galaxy that merged with the Milky Way long ago. But it's the age of Methuselah that truly puzzles astronomers. Early estimates put the star at around 16 billion years old. More accurate calculations later adjusted that number to about 14.46 billion years, give or take 800 million years. Still, this is older than the widely accepted age of the universe, which is 13.8 billion years. This creates a paradox. How can a star be older than the universe it exists in? It seems impossible, yet the data raises real questions. Astronomers are now examining their tools and methods to ensure their measurements are accurate. They also wonder if the models they use to estimate ages might need updating. Figuring out a star's age is a difficult task. Most stars, like our Sun, don't change much over billions of years making it hard to tell how old they are. Scientists rely on clues like brightness and color, comparing them to models of how stars evolve over time. Another method is called gyrochronology, which measures how fast a star spins. Just like a spinning top slows down with time, stars also rotate more slowly as they age. This slowdown gives scientists a way to estimate how long a star has existed. Methuselah is clearly one of the oldest stars ever found. Instead of focusing on whether it's truly older than the universe, some scientists have started asking a deeper question. What if the universe is actually older than we think? To imagine this, think of the universe's history as a single year. The Big Bang would occur on January 1st Street. Earth wouldn't appear until December 31st, and human civilization would take up just a few seconds. Traditionally, scientists estimate the universe's age by studying light from the farthest galaxies. This light has taken billions of years to reach us. As space expands, this light stretches out and shifts to the red end of the spectrum. This effect is called redshift, and it helps scientists estimate distance and time. Using this method, they've settled on an age of about 13.8 billion years for the universe. But some recent research suggests this number could be wrong. A new idea from the University of Ottawa has raised eyebrows. Physicist Dr. Rajendra Gupta believes the universe might be as old as 26.7 billion years. He revisited theories first introduced in 1929 by Swiss astronomer Fritz Zwicky and combined them with modern science. His proposal suggests that redshift might not come only from expansion. Instead, Particles like protons might lose energy over time, which could also stretch the light. If this is true, our current understanding of how to measure age and distance in space could be flawed. This new view could help explain some of the strange things the James Webb Telescope has seen. It also connects with ideas from physicists like Paul Dirac, who believe that the universe's constants may have changed over time. It's important to remember that our estimates for the universe's age have changed many times. In the 1920s, Edwin Hubble thought it was only about 2 billion years old. As time passed and technology improved, scientists kept updating the number. 
Eventually, they landed on the current estimate of 13.8 billion years. But this could change again. The Milky Way, our galaxy, is also full of surprises. Recent studies show that stars on its edges move more slowly than expected. This could mean our galaxy has less dark matter, a mysterious, invisible substance, than we thought. Dark matter is believed to affect gravity and hold galaxies together. The European Space Agency's Gaia mission has mapped nearly 2 billion stars. Its data is helping scientists understand star movements in more detail than ever before. By analyzing how fast stars orbit, researchers can estimate how much mass the galaxy holds. Some newer calculations suggest the Milky Way might be five times lighter than previously believed. If true, this means there may be much less dark matter than we thought. But these numbers are hard to get right, and there could be errors or missing information. As new data comes in, scientists update their models to be more accurate. Advanced technology is helping make these updates faster and more precise. The James Webb Telescope is playing a big role in this. As we move into the future, one thing is clear. Astronomy is entering a new era of discovery. We are on the edge of understanding things that seemed impossible before. Whether it's finding the age of the universe or searching for life on distant planets, the questions keep growing. And the answers may change the world. Subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching.